phrase is just like cutting a croissant. Frozen a butter croissant. knife. A frozen croissant. Mm -hmm. I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything on my plate. Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. And welcome back to another weekly vlog. As you can tell, I just got out of the shower. I've got a face mask. It's like a really random one. I've got a big bin under my sink of like skincare. So I just pulled out this like avocado healing mask. It's currently 11 a.m. I haven't gone to the gym this morning. I woke up at like seven um, to my alarm. I think I just went straight back to sleep and then I woke up again at like 8 a.m. I totally could have still gone to the gym. I just wasn't feeling it, so I decided to just miss this morning. I might go this afternoon. Oh, Rose, back. I might go this afternoon. We'll see how we're feeling. But pretty much all of yesterday, I had a really upset stomach. And I don't know, it wasn't like... Oh, hang on. Freya's just come back from a haircut. Hang on. I don't want to talk about it. What? Yeah, Frey just got a haircut. She doesn't like it though, but I think it looks stunning. But anyway, yeah, I had a really weird upset stomach yesterday. It was like, unlike anything I've ever felt before. I don't know if it was like from grilled or what. It was just like, I don't think it was acid reflux, but it felt like just like the way I described it was like acid in my stomach. <laughs> I don't know. And even today, I'm still feeling a little bit like not quite right. So I think that's why I just I'm trying to take it easy this morning. But um, yeah, basically I have finished the weekly vlog. My, I love Mondays because I know exactly what I'm doing. Like I wake up, I finish off the weekly vlog, get it all done. And then I've also decided that Monday is going to be my tanning day just because it makes more sense with my schedule and stuff. So I've just taken off my tan and I actually have a doctor's call in about... 15 minutes time just regarding like blood tests that I had done the other week because I'm figuring out my hormones she was like did you want to come in or just talk on the phone I'm like talk on the phone because <laughs> then I don't have to leave my house so yeah I'm gonna make the weekly vlog thumbnail get that all ready to go and then I think I'm gonna have a pretty big week this week in terms of like house stuff tomorrow my dad and I are probably gonna go to like the good guys Harvey Norman or one of those places and just buy everything <laughs> Like always get it ordered. So get like the fridge, dishwasher, washing machine, microwave, all the big things and be like, what? what's the best deal you can do for us there? So get that done. Maybe even get internet sorted. So yeah, it's all happening. A bit of a different start to my normal Monday routine, but that's all right. So now you're here again, knocking at my door. A little too late for I'm sorry for The lights went out cause you kept cutting the cord And I started to fade into your grave See I finally opened up my eyes And I saw me coming back to life That I'd be better without you inside It's time to be someone I wanna recognize Okay, so I just experimented trying to make these like zucchini fritter 
things. I think I need to get like a cheesecloth because the zucchini is really wet. So it kind of doesn't allow the patties to stay together. I also think I need to like find a combination of like dry ingredients to make it stick. But I mean, I feel like these are still gonna taste really, really yum. So I'm trying to experiment with my meals because I feel like you guys probably get sick of them. But we're gonna give this a go. I'm sure it'll be very delicious. Oh my god, that is delicious. It's kind of mushy, but it tastes really good. The future is now not backing down Cause the future is now guys happy Tuesday it is currently 10 51 a.m. and we're about to do some house shopping today we're probably gonna get everything ordered as much as we can so we can kind of like ask them what's the best price and everything I brought my camera and I thought I popped it on charge but I mustn't have done it so it's dead um, but I'm excited nervous because it's gonna be very expensive obviously hopefully we can get like a fridge washing machine dishwasher Maybe a TV, maybe a microwave, maybe a Dyson. Just, it's all happening. You and me, we staying out so late. Spending all the money that we make. Auntie Faka and Big Lemonade. We go hard at making big mistakes. guys happy wednesday um i'm about to pop on my makeup and i thought i look great i'm about to pop on my makeup um and i thought i would chat with you because i feel like um this vlog probably seems fairly normal but in actuality is that word? i wasn't sure whether i was going to address this in the vlog just because i feel like when you talk about health problems or any type of issue you get a lot of like um people wanting to help which obviously is really nice but it's hard when like I'm showing you guys a fraction of like my life and stuff. Um, so there's a lot that goes on that you don't know. So it's like if I say something like, oh, I've got a sore finger. A lot of people make assumptions about what's the cause of it and like people try and diagnose you and everything. So, but I feel like I need to address it. Otherwise it's just me in my head at least. It's weird. So on Sunday, I don't, I think it was, so this is the night after I had grilled, if you saw my weekly vlog. My stomach felt a bit weird, like, it just kind of felt like weird indigestion and like, wasn't anything too concerning. I was just kind of like, oh, you know, maybe the grill didn't agree with me or whatever. I think I even said it in the vlog. And then Monday, I kind of still felt that way. And I was just kind of feeling a bit like weird in my stomach. And then it was almost like, I was describing it as acid reflux, but then I don't think it was acid reflux because... I don't know, it, but it, it just felt like a weird acidy situation in my stomach. I've never felt this sensation before, so I was very like, what is this? But it was like, whatever. And then I was eating my dinner on Monday night. And like, mind you, I haven't started eating anything like super out of the ordinary. And when I was eating my dinner, I had this like intense pain in my stomach. And like, it's so hard to describe. And it was like a burning sensation and it, it was really painful. And I had to stop eating. And I was like, oh my God. And I was just like, whoa, whoa, whoa. But it was like so, like a weird burning sensation. <laughs> Sounds kind of scary, but it was just like, like this feeling is what I would think you would feel if you had, you would like eat 
to excess, like eat a mountain of food, which to the point where you're in pain, like that's what it felt like. So I was just kind of like, oh my God. And I had to stop and I was like, whoa, this is really painful. I ended up deciding to go to emergency just because I was like, what is this? Um, <laughs> so went to emergency, waited for like three hours. So by the time I was like seen, the pains like subsided. They gave me this thing called like a pink lady. It was like for acid reflux and like gastro stuffed it kind of like numbed my mouth anyway we i was like super tired <laughs> and part of me at the end i was like should we just leave but we had waited so long to the which obviously is fine because i'm not like there are people in front of me because they have they're more high priority obviously but we were like well we should go in now we waited this long so the doctor said like yep yeah, it's probably gastritis i think she said so it's the pain comes when i like eat really but like i had my breakfast yesterday and it was fine dad and i went um, house shopping and whatnot and then I had my lunch when I came back and the same thing It's just like it was like this excruciating pain now. It's not as burning, but it's just like pain Um, The tablets, I think what are they called? They do help they kind of like after a bit if I take them right after I've eaten They help like settle my stomach a bit, but then I had a nap because I was very tired from the night before I woke up and I was like, whoa. Even now, like I'm not in pain. I can just feel that something's off. I'm not even sure if I'm going to include this clip because I don't want you guys like freaking out and stuff. But same thing. I had, I even had a smoothie yesterday afternoon and it's just like straight away this pain as if I've eaten a lot of food and that's, that's what the feeling is, I guess. So I'm going to the doctor this morning to see what we can do. Apparently the doctor and the emergency room said that people can get a bug and that can be like treated. Like that's the reason for it, which I have a feeling that's probably what it is because it just came out of nowhere like i have never had this before ever i don't know that's the update Ho hopefully within this vlog we will solve the problem so it won't be like this mystery thing but i just felt like i needed to update you because otherwise it's just kind of like weird so if <laughs> this weekly vlog isn't amazing i'm sorry oh my god why am i sweating so much like right now i'm fine it just feels like i'm a bit bloated it's weird basically what i've been trying to do is eat a lot smaller meals obviously because you guys know i have such high volume which is good but at the moment since my stomach is like playing up i'm just trying to eat very slowly very like like my, my pancakes this morning were fine but today i'm hoping to film some hauls this morning like the talking part before i go to the doctor because i'm going at 11. it's currently 10 past 9 um and i, did, I haven't gone to the gym this morning i was but i was just like no connor like i don't know how my stomach is gonna react as soon as i start doing some like hit exercise so i've had a break i haven't gone since sunday hopefully tomorrow i will be able to go because it's weights i need to continue to do my makeup yeah, just to keep you guys in the loop with what's going on. Not sure, my stomach's a bit weird. But yeah, I wasn't gonna talk about it just because yeah, I feel like health issues just opens up a massive door of like um, opinions, which is perfectly fine. This is like my, I'm putting myself on the internet, like I'm opening up the door for people to comment what they think. Yeah, keep in mind that you guys only see a very small portion of my life, so you don't exactly know what's really going on um, in the nicest way possible. Oh, I, feel like I, I feel like I'm being mean. Hopefully we can figure what's going on. I, I need to stop sweating, that's one problem. It's so hot in here, it is so hot today. You know it's summer when you do your makeup like this. January in Australia, or at least like Brisbane, Australia, is just like January, February are just stinking hot. Like hot where it's not fun. I don't like it. Anyway, yeah, so a little update. It seems to get progressively worse as the day goes on. I think it's because there's obviously food in my stomach. I'll show you the Dyson though that I got. <laughs> I showed you guys the fridge. I'll pop a, a photo on the screen of what fridge I got. Just because obviously I don't, I'm so, I wish I could do like a haul of what I got, but I can't because I don't have any of it except the Dyson. I just got the same model that my family has. By the way, just side note, recommendation. If you are buying a house, moving, renting, whatever, and you want to buy like, like a fridge, washing machine, dish, like those things, like kind of the essentials, I would recommend going to one place like the good guys, we went to the good guys and getting all the stuff, like picking out and then say to them, okay, we're gonna get all of this. Like hey, what's the best deal you can do? I went with my dad, so he did all of that part. But I think in the end, we got like quite a bit of money off because we got it all in like one place in one go. So I would recommend that because I mean, a discount's a discount. It's not sponsored by the way, <laughs> I wish. But yeah, I'm so excited for the fridge because originally I had picked out one, but it was discontinued. I'm just gonna spray my face with the Matte Fix Plus. 
just because I don't want to put any powder on. Um, the one that I originally picked out was like this Samsung fridge, but I think it was discontinued. Of course, the one that I would pick is discontinued. Um, you know when they and like say yes to the dress? This is such a random comparison where they say, oh, my budget's this much. And then they're like, but I really want to try on that dress that's like out of their budget. And it's like, oh, don't do that because, you know, you're probably going to fall in love with it and then you're probably going to want to buy it. Not that that was me. I didn't really have a budget necessarily. Obviously, I wasn't planning on buying a $10,000 fridge, which I didn't. But do you know what I mean? It's kind of that mentality so yeah it was kind of like one that was like on display and looked really pretty and i was just like oh i like you you're very nice to look at the price wasn't terrible considering like what it was and everything but i'm very excited she's very pretty she's got like a nice little opening door and everything um all right 15 minutes i've been recording and i've done foundation concealer and then i got a microwave that's really cool <laughs> some of the items like the dishwasher and well, the washing machine, I think I got one from Fisher and Paykel. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. It's the same one that my family has. And like, I just kind of went off my dad's recommendations because obviously he's been alive a lot longer than I have. He's had more houses. He was like, yeah, this one's good. I'm like, cool. And then, oh, Christ. And then what else? Oh, we got a TV. I'm not that fussed on the TV. I didn't need to get like a huge. I just wanted one that fit the wall. I was like, cool, because literally the only thing I watch on TV is Netflix, YouTube, and like the news. <laughs> so I don't need like a million and one features and I don't, I don't really care. Um, I feel like as I get older, the less TV I really watch. I'm going to use Enco. This is such a pretty blush. Enco Lip and Cheek Tint. So yeah, but the picture's really nice because we were going to get, I picked out one because I don't know much about TVs, but um, the guy was like, that one's not in stock, but this one is better and it's yeah i think it's by high sense but and then is that everything got the main things out of the way obviously we've still kind of got a couch to think about and obviously a lot more stuff but it's just kind of nice knowing that the fridge dishwasher washing machine those are like big appliances i'm sunburnt trust the process yeah, I want to have a productive day today, or as, look at that glow though, side note. I want to be as productive as I can, given the circumstances. I'm not going to go to the gym today. I look like I've just spent, <laughs> I look like I fell asleep in the sun. I just hope that one day we both can have the money. The whole Olivia Rodrigo stuff with like Sabrina Carpenter. I love Sabrina Carpenter. I've always been a fan of her. A lot of people tell me I look like her. Definitely not at this point in time, I don't, but um, which I'm like, wow, biggest compliment ever because she's gorgeous. But yeah, the tea, when I heard her song, I, which I love, I please don't come for me, Olivia Rodrigo fans. Like, I'm not, I'm very neutral. I'm Switzerland in this position. Like, I don't really know much about the drama. Like, I do, but I don't. I love both songs. <laughs> but like, oof. If that's a marketing ploy, that's the smartest marketing ploy I've ever seen in my life. It is so hot. I can't wait for it to get cooler. This blush is so glowy. Oh, I love it. But I think on Friday, Michaela, Freya and I are going to go out for some gal drinks. Which should be fun. So I want to kind of film a get, a get ready with me reel. Kind of like, <laughs> you know the, the song from Victorious where it's like, Are you listening? Hear me talk. Hear me say. Open up the door. Is it less? Is it more? And you tell me to be where? Are you here? Are you there? Is it some? I want to do it like that, but like getting ready. So to be like me being like, are you listening? Yeah, you get you get my point. So I feel like that'd be quite fun. I was I haven't done a reel or a TikTok in ages. Also, the fact that we're nearly in February, but then also December feels like a million years ago. So I don't know what's really happening with anything. It's funny how like sometimes you can be so in the mood to do your makeup and then other times I couldn't think of anything worse than putting on makeup. It's weird. I need to get my brows laminated again. Hey, Hi. That is my makeup today. All right. Good morning, guys. Happy uh, Thursday. I'm at the gym. It is nice and early. My dad today is having um, laser eye surgery, which I think is called LASIK. It's because he has something like wrong with his eyes, so he's getting that 
so he's getting one done so my mum's taking him to the hospital this morning and then i'm gonna pick him up at about 9 30 i think so that'll be part of my day today and then what else do i need to get done today i'm pretty good for content i think and then friday i think i have to take my dad somewhere as well for his like follow-up in the morning and then yeah i will bring you along i'm wearing a gymshark set this morning that is so pretty <sighs> Just got done with the session. Let me end my workout. That was really hard, to be honest. I feel like because I've been like sick or not eating probably my right like macros and stuff because I've been so out of my normal routine, but I'm glad it's done now. afternoon guys it's i've been a terrible vlogger this week but i feel like i need to cut myself some slack because i have not been well but i'm actually feeling pretty good today like i haven't had any bad pains while in my meals so i'm very i'm confident that like it's just a bug and i'll be fine but yeah i grabbed my dad from his appointment as you saw he's got an eye patch on at the moment because he's they do one eye at a time then i popped out to the supermarket for my dad to pick up some food because he wanted to make something for dinner and i actually like like completely decluttered my vanity um i just decluttered a whole bunch of makeup i feel like this week is just i don't want to call it a write-off week but i'm just not feeling motivated people always ask me like why how are you so motivated i'm not i'm really unmotivated this week and i've said like when i feel unmotivated it's usually because i need to rest so i'm probably just gonna take it easy this week and then try and get back into the swing of things next week i mean i've still been getting stuff done but i just am not been in my jam i feel like january is really hard to get like back into routine and stuff and since i haven't had a routine really all this week i'm just feel like frazzled and stuff so but i managed to declutter like a lot of my makeup so i mean it's still a lot like look at this ready <gasps> oh it's so nice and fresh and i've just put a bunch of it um in a shoe box that i'm either going to give to friends donate or i've just thrown away like super expired makeup and i'm talking makeup that is literally five six years old that I had to just go in the bin but right now it's nearly 3 p.m. I just had a smoothie. I'm feeling okay. I'm gonna take some. I'm not sure I understand. Go away, Siri. I'm gonna take, they're called my Lanta. That's the stomach little tablets that I've been taking. And I've also got antibiotics from the doctor. I think I'm gonna do some nails. I haven't had nails on for a long time because I've been trying to have a break, basically. My nails aren't looking too crash hot. It's because I bite the skin around my nails. I can't help it. I also cleaned up this side of my, like this angle, my nail drawer. So, what nails do we want to do? Let me see. I really need to order more nails on Amazon. But we are the ones to never give in, no matter what the world throws at us. You always have me, and I have you. Your defeat won't go unnoticed 
Good morning guys, happy Friday. Um, I've just gotten ready for the gym. I'm wearing the Stax monochrome collection. Um, they're doing like a little restock this morning of like this color, I think. The lighting's not cute. I'm just having a little apple and a coffee is pre-workout for the gym. Just because I don't really like doing like fasted cardio anymore. It's funny how I did intermittent fasting, which worked really well for me when I had a different goal, but my goal is not weight loss. Also, <laughs> my nails. I didn't have any nail glue. I used like the top coat to stick on the nails and it worked for the time being, but they kind of just started popping off. So, because I ran out of my nail glue as I was like sitting down to do it. So I just popped them all off. So I think before the gym, probably, I'm gonna pop into Kmart and grab some glue so I can glue them on. I'm feeling a lot better, a lot better. Like yesterday, I didn't have any like bad um, pains or anything. Like I feel like it's getting better. So that makes me think that it was a bug. I've still got antibiotics that I got from the doctor, so. So, my dad, let me show you. He has these glasses. <laughs> These are the glasses um, to wear when he's like outside, or at least yesterday. <laughs> oh my god. I, I like can't see the screen. It's made. <gasps> oh my god, it's like made the screen go all weird. Wow. He has a follow up appointment today at 1.40, I think. So I am going to take him to that. The first sip of your coffee, side note, is glorious. Ugh. I've also been really good about my coffee. I've only had one, like since I went to the emergency room on Monday night. Tuesday I had none, Wednesday I had one, Thursday I only had one. But one thing, I've been having really, really bad night sleeps. Yesterday I wasn't too bad. Anyway, I have my coffee, I'll probably leave to go to the gym maybe like 8.30, have a wander around Kmart. Mm. I think I'm gonna have some pre-workout that I'm gonna make up. I'm only gonna do maybe like a little bit less than I normally would just because there is like caffeine in here and I don't wanna like irritate my stomach, even though I'm sure I'll be fine. Like I feel kind of back to normal now. So I'm also gonna make some BCAAs. Also, Naked Harvest or Georgie, if you're watching this, please come out with BCAAs. I would love that because then pre-workout and my BCAAs were oh natural, <laughs> you know. So this look at the size of this packet. I want to get rid of it, but I don't want to get rid of it. This is so smooth though, like. Okay. Kmart didn't have the glue that I normally get, so I had to get like the X, what's it called? The XO brand? Um, it's the OXX Studio brand. Oh my nails are tragic. They're so bad. <laughs> um, so hopefully this works, but I'm gonna head to the gym now. Pump up songs, all right? High School Musical? I think yes. Play a ball. Oh.
every day Take all your secrets to my grave You and me against everything They say we're bad for each other But they don't know us They don't know us Ride or die, we gon' stick together Ain't nobody I trust like us Yeah, I know we're fucked up, but We're fucking amazing I'm gonna drive home now. My camera's gonna die anyway. I just completely zoned out then. That was an amazing session. That was like a mixture of resistance and cardio, which is like my all time favorite. We don't do it that often, but I wish we did. It's so good. I feel amazing right now. Cause like yesterday I felt really tired and weak and stuff, but I felt so strong and fit then. Like not to sound like I'm, I think I'm Wonder Woman or whatever. But. So it's now 3 p.m. The day has just gone by like that. It's funny how sometimes days just go can go so fast and sometimes they can go so slow. I took my dad to his follow-up appointment. That was all good. That took a big chunk out of the day because it's like kind of 50 minutes there, 50 minutes there, 50 minutes back. So my hair has kind of like air dried probably 80%. So I'm just going to blow dry it and then I think, do I want to? I'm gonna blow dry my hair, then do my makeup, then curl my hair and do all the rest of it. So, I will show you the process. To put in words how the colors are blooming To try to count how fast my heart is booming I just roughly blow dried my hair Now we're gonna move on to makeup Alright, time for the makeup portion of this video Now, I'm gonna go in with this Laura Mercier Pure Canvas Primer just gonna, I'm gonna do pretty simple makeup today I think Nothing too fancy I'm just gonna pop on this headband this is a very illuminating primer. I'm sorry about the fan. For foundation, we're going to use Hourglass. It's my favorite. My skin is being pretty good at the moment. We are improving. Oh no. I guess. Okay, this is not going well thus far. <laughs> I'm gonna pop on some Fix Plus. Ah! Jazz, if you're watching this, love you girl. She sent me a little goodie package, so let me open this. Hang on. So, Jazz sent a little parcel. Look at the packaging, it's like all red for Valentine's Day. Oh, look how cute. So, that's what we've got. Some really cute little studs. Oh, so oh, there's so much. Oh my, bro, that is too nice of, oh my God, Jazz, thank you so much. Oh, I hope enough, I have enough time. I really wanna wear these tonight. Where's that? Is that like a, <gasps> dead, 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 dead. Oh, there's so much here, but I need, I need to get ready. I'm like, <laughs> ah! I feel like I need to not make my reel. It's not coming out how I want it. Yeah, I'm gonna not make my reel because it's just gonna take up too much time. Oh well, okay, I feel better. I am going to attack the task at hand. Foundation, concealer done. Look how glowy that um, Fix Plus made my skin. Okay, see so I've decluttered all my makeup, so I'm like, where is everything? We're just gonna do bronzer in the crease, hey? Yeah. What's new, pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I love how I'm like, oh my god, I need so much time to do my makeup when this is what I'm doing. What's new, pussycat? I'm literally, I've hit pan on this. It is my favorite bronzer of all time. <laughs> and it's hard to describe this feel I feel. Okay, then I'm gonna take a darker shadow and kind of go under my lash line. There's a hair on my face. Just to define the eye a little bit. 
and I'm gonna pop some on my lash line, not just like on the outer edge here. Nothing too. I know me a bunch of people are screaming. I just ignore and then go on with the dream. So that's all up to you. Okay, so I popped in the extensions and I don't know what it is. It must be like the way my hands move from like I can do my left side but my right side fringe just will not style the right way for the life of me and I don't want to keep putting heat on it because I'm going to fry it off. So I don't know whether it looks also I put in the jazz earrings. <gasps> They're so cute. Hang on let me show you. Like look. Um, so they're like all the bottom ones here. Oh, they're so cute. I just can't do it. So I think I'm just going to have to wear my hair like this. But then does that look stupid? Unless I just can like always wear it. I don't know. I'm going to wear this white set. Freya's picking out an outfit currently. Oh, <gasps> actually, that's a dress. That's really pretty. It's from Beginning Boutique. The fabric's really nice. It's a bit cute. It's a bit that's a bit cutie. It's, a bit cute. um, but it's very dressy. I know, but I feel like we're all going for that vibe. Switching. Okay, so I'm filming on my phone because my camera is dead. This is the fit. I love this set. I think it's so stunning, elegant, whatever. Like, it's the Huxley set from Princess Polly in white. I also have it in black. And then I've got the extensions in. I think I'm just going to literally wear my hair like this. One side tucked behind my ear and the other out because I've given up. Um, I've got on the jazz necklace as well. And then the earrings and stuff. I feel like I want to have my hair tucked behind my ears anyway because it shows off the earrings. I feel like a lot of people are against ear tucking, but um, I think it looks fine, so. Yeah, and then these shoes are from Nasty Gal. So that is the fit. We'll probably leave in about six o'clock, I think. Yes. Okay, so it's now the next day. It is currently 10.30. I went to sleep probably like 2.30 a.m. last night. We had some drinks at, we had, <laughs> we just had some drinks with me and some friends and then we all decided to come back to my house, our house. I feel like I should, I feel like weird not saying like our house. The guys had a swim. Freya made us some drinks that were very strong. Now Freya and I are gonna go, <laughs> Freya and I are going to head to the shops because I think Freya wants to get some earrings maybe because hers are a bit infected. Also, I've got in my Jazz handmade earrings at the moment. I've got a little like, ear cuff. But um, I also took off my nails and the tan on my hands. What has happened there? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Freya's just like cutting a croissant. A frozen a croissant. Knife. A frozen croissant. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go buy a microphone, a second one for the podcast, I think. Maybe get some house stuff. I talk to write out my brain, keep on freezing. Can't see no point in resisting the teaser. I'm the same ride. I'm just a disaster. It's currently quarter past 12. Having a very slow morning. I'm doing some washing my bed sheets currently. Um, and then I've just edited some of the weekly vlog. I had a really good sleep. I was absolutely exhausted when I went to sleep last night, obviously, because I was running on little sleep and I didn't have a nap yesterday. I ended up picking up like this like satin robe thing from Kmart just for like tanning and stuff. I got a pan from Kmart and a pop socket. <laughs> Freya got some earrings and I didn't end up going getting a microphone. I've been saying this for like weeks, but they didn't have any at JB Hi-Fi. So I think today I'm going to order that online, get that done. But yeah, I will check in with you guys later. I try to write out my brain, keep on freezing. Can't see no point 